Officer, do you have details? Megablock insurgents stowed away on the plane. After it landed, they took hostages. They're demanding the release of war prisoners. What's the plan? I'm not too sure, but supposedly there's a counter-terrorist unit en route. Mike, Paul, I want you two to grab some SWAT guys. Pull security. Watch the rear of the plane and the entry doorway. Got it. Who's the officer in charge here? I am, sir. Get sniper teams covering all entrances and exits to the plane. Tell them to watch the windows as a secondary objective. Keep them as hidden as you can. Yes, sir. We can only approach the plane from the rear. Gary and I will take the back entrance. Randy and Steve, take the front. But Murph, if we enter from two opposite sides, won't we end up shooting at each other? We don't have another choice, Gary. If we only breach from one end, they could fall back into one end of the plane and execute hostages, and their safety is above ours every time. Without full kit, it's gonna be even riskier. If we were in full kit, it could get caught in the narrow confines of the plane. We'll wear soft armor only, under our clothes to remain low profile and not noteworthy. Once we're in there, we'll need to be as maneuverable as possible. This is why we train, gents. Okay, sir, we've carefully analyzed the situation. It looks like there's four hijackers. The hostages are fine for now, but we don't know for how much longer. They've been threatening to begin killing them for a while now, so we might be in a time crunch. We should get moving then. Alpha and Charlie, in position. Bravo and Delta, ready. Echo, Foxtrot, Golf, in position. Execute, execute, execute. Clear. All clear. They're getting bolder. The insurgency is at least, their military is at least on the defensive still. Stand by, gents. One of these days, something is going to pop off.